welcome, welcome, welcome. My screen keeps going in and out. I don't know what is wrong with my lighting tonight, but you know. <laughs> Y'all, yay! It's Disney night. It's Disney. Yes. Ash. Yay. It's Disney. Look, look, look. Look, I got my I got my Disney heart hands on. <laughs> Yay. And look, Gabby, Gabby is right in here making sure that y'all remember to please click that like button. Just do it right now before we get distracted with all the Disney-ness. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Manny, Manny saying, join grandma as she takes you on a nostalgic journey through Disney's magical timeline. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, all the good stuff. Thank you, Manny. Manny, Manny, are you in Hawaii? I think you're in Hawaii now. Hello. <laughs> I love it so much. Do I like your new profile? Yes. Yes, I do. I do like that. That looks pretty cool. Wow, Manny, you're amazing. Yes, Manny is amazing. I love it. Um, everybody saying hello, hello to each other, yeah, or good day or night, <laughs> even though what day I Gabby, y'all, I have come to the conclusion that Gabby is AI because she never she I never sleeps. <laughs> She never sleeps and she is super mod to so many channels. Um, so yeah, I took a nap, Gabby. <laughs> I set my alarm so I would wake up for this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I I'm ready. Are you ready? Are y'all ready for Disney? I'm ready. I think Ash is ready. <laughs> Gabby's ready. Manny is ready. Yes, it is going to be so fun. So this one is different. Um, yes, nostalgia. Oh, Manny, that's a big word for you, buddy. I'm impressed. <laughs> Haven't watched Disney in one month. This is not stuff that you need to have been watching Disney for. So this is, um, but I'll still feel nostalgia. You're so adorable. I just could reach through the screen and just squeeze you, Manny. <laughs> Gabby, are you watching me? Yes, we are watching you. <laughs> yep, first I'm watching with all four of her eyes. She's got many eyes because she's AI. We could program her to have more eyes. <laughs> that would be scary. Ash, please don't win all the trivias. <laughs> hey, Manny, look, she might win them, but she doesn't get them all right. I mean, out of 35 last night, she only got 29. So, you know, there is room for y'all to take over. Um, It's not, it's so not right. I'm sorry. You're so funny. Um. I'm, I'm, I gotta just get down there. Oh, Ash has already started putting in her equations. <laughs> All right, I'm skipping down here because y'all were talking before I even got in here. Uncle Roger knows best. <laughs> Uncle Roger. <laughs> Berrios, hello, Berrios, my potatoes, me and my and my potatoes is here. Nick Bell, hello, buddy, hello. Yep, Manny's in Hawaii doing the hula, doing the hula. Manny is in Hawaii. Oh, in Honolulu. Mm, very good. I am so jealous. I didn't get packed quick enough. He left without me. <laughs> you won't get robbed. No, just don't, just, just, just be safe. Okay. It's not Italy <laughs> or Greece. They'll get you. 
Hawaii, Hawaii is not as bad. So, um, um, I'm skipping. Oh, it's not letting you super chat $15. Manny, I don't want you super chat in $15. You need to save it and, and spend it on yourself in Hawaii. Okay. As much as grandma absolutely loves that. Um, I want, I, I, I don't want, you, $15 is a lot for you guys. Y'all Manny, that's Manny's graduation money that he got from going, he's going into the sixth grade. So, um, <clears throat> yes, grandma appreciates all the super chats, but Manny, seriously, buddy, I love you. And I want you, you worked really, really hard for that money. Okay. Um, a dollar, a dollar you can do a dollar but not 15 okay i appreciate that though more than you believe okay i i truly do um it's the thought yep it's me not real i don't sleep i'm serious i'm serious um oh i'm still waiting grandma my extra ticket to why is here well hey if i can still make it <laughs> Hello, Eddie. Hello. So glad you're here, Eddie. Y'all, we have this new game. All right. So that's why you're looking at it. it this is kind of, I've got it kind of set up like the way we do Wordle. So the setup is kind of like Wordle, but it's not. <laughs> it is a super good game. Um, It's, uh, there's my color again. Um the way, the way it works, um, grandma, you gotta be quicker than that. Hold on a minute. I'm scooping down here. I'm waiting for you to pack your bag. Okay. There you go. All right. I, I've caught up. <laughs> yes. It, it'll be different, but fine. It's going to be really fun. And I've got, I'm not, I'm not just going to do Disney. I also have like, um, uh, I got it today. It's just random stuff. I noticed there's some things about some movies. There's things like history. Um, but everything has to do with dates. All right. Dates. And you don't have to get the exact date. Um, so if you don't know the exact date, it's fine. It doesn't matter. So the way the game works is, oh, wait, I'm waiting. Hurry. I'm waiting for you, Grandma. I can Manny, <laughs> I mean, the plane is taking off today. <laughs> I'll run. I'll run, Manny. <laughs> 10 p.m. Oh, only have an hour. We won't, we won't be done. <laughs> <in time. laughs> oh, Manny. Oh, my goodness. Well, I hope you're at the airport. <clears throat> I hope you're at the airport right now. Because if the plane takes off at 10 Eastern, um, it is uh, 9.08 right now. <laughs> All right. So back to the game. All right. The way we're going to play this game is really, really easy. Okay. So you're going to see the screen right here that you're looking at. Not me, but this other part where it says Disney chronologically. That screen is going to change just like it does with the trivia. All right. And you're going to see a, qu a statement. All right. And I'm going to give you a month. And then when you're going to type in the date that you think it happened. All right. And um, there is a cat tickling my feet. That is just funny, weird feeling. Um, so you're going to type in, we'll just use like 1961. All right. So you type in 1961 to answer the question. And if it's 1970, then it's going to put you kind of like in a range. So if other people get closer, you know, to, to the, the date, it's going to put you in a range and that's how you get the points. So the one that's closest to the actual, um, the actual date will get more points and then it goes down for that from there. Okay. <clears throat> so as we get going, you'll see it's not difficult at all. So in the chat, you're going to be putting just the number date, like 1961 would be 1961. You just put in that. Okay. So, and only do it one time because it's only going to take your first number. 
All right. So, um, yes, Manny says, I'm at the airport. I'm at the airport. Okay, so here we go. A fiery young man and a go-with-the-flow guy discovers how much they have in common in Pixar's Elemental, June of what year? So pretty much what it's saying is, when did Pixar's Elemental debut okay june of what year june of what year pixar's elemental so just put in the chat what year what year was pixar's g uh uh elemental <clears throat> All right, me and Maya and Ash. Now, so you're going to see your your names pop up. Oh, my goodness. Is it going to do it? Let me look over here and see. It's supposed to be showing your thing. It didn't show your names. Okay. Oh, I think it's because y'all waited. All right, so Manny, Manny got in him first. Manny got it right. It was, you can see the correct answer is 2023. All right. Y'all see how they do it? All right. The animated musical film Aladdin premieres at the El Capitan Theater in Hollywood, November of what year? I know, Manny, Manny, good job. Um, <laughs> beer malfunctioning. <laughs> I twitches. There won't be any any ads running during the game. All right. So Eddie says 1994. See how you're when you put it in, it's gonna pop up. Okay. Mia Maya 92. Manny says 92. All right, let's see. Lori Jean says 2005. Correct answer is 92. 92. All right. Ash got, got it in first. So Ash got 70 points on that one. Then Nehemiah, Eddie, and Lori. All right. See how y'all are getting the points as you go down? It, it gives you, you get points. It's just who gets closer gets the most. All right. Y'all are doing good. So answer because you get points. The animated film 101 Dalmatians opens and features over 6 million spots. January of what year? When they opened, they had like in the theaters, they had like spots everywhere was the big thing. They had spots all over the theater and stuff. The animated film 101 Dalmatian opens and features over 6 million spots. All right, Eddie says 62. Y'all just guess because guessing still gets you points. All right, Manny says 61. Mia says 61. Ash, what's happening to you? Lori said 63. It was 61. Look at y'all. Oh, my youngins are getting you. 61. Mia got that one in first. So Mia got the 70 points. Good job. Good job. Ash, Ash, refresh. I think you're a little slow, babe. Pixar's Soul debuts on Disney+. Plus. It is about a band teacher who goes to great lengths to find his spark. December of what year? <laughs> Ash put in 505, so they took that number. Ash. <laughs> Ash says the year 505. <laughs> uh, Ash, it already took 505. Don't put any numbers in. If you put any number, it's going to take that number. That is hilarious. Okay, we'll see how close you are at 2020. Uh, but you're not going to get those points. <laughs> Thanks, computer. <laughs> All right. It's 2020, Ash. <laughs> 
Lori got it. Yay, Gigi. Lori got it. Lori got 72 points. Very good. Very good. I don't know how. I don't. Oh, wait. I think it divides between between the people. I think. I, I don't know exactly. I'll have to go read. The Great Mouse Detective mm -hmm. premieres starring Basil of Baker Street and the Evil Radigan. July of what year? Your grandma is helping you. Good. We like it. Yay, grandma. Give grandma my love. Grandma is helping. All right. Great Mouse Detective. What year? Manny says 86. Lori says 84. 86, 86. Okay, y'all. Grandma's got some thunder out here. <laughs> if for some reason, grandma's power, internet, whatever happens, if anything happens, this game will keep going. That's why grandma loves going through this game. All right, let's see. So y'all just keep playing. All right, Mia, Maya, my potatoes. Yay. Mia got it. It was 1986. Ash got it. Eddie got it. Manny got it. Good job, y'all. Very good. But Mia got it in first. Woohoo. Oh, you can Google. <laughs> Cinderella makes Bibbidi Bobbidi Boo de debut in movie theaters. February of what year? Manny, that makes no sense. What makes no sense? Mia says, I don't use, I don't use Google. Google's, don't use Google. Just guess. It's fine. All right. So Ash says 1950. Cinderella, bibbity bobbity booed into theaters. Eddie, 50. I don't know if y'all can hear the storm. Hopefully it'll blow through real quick. and won't. I'm going to interrupt. <laughs> oh, Lori said 64. Mia says 50. 50. 50. Grandma. Oh. What? <laughs> Grandma says what? Mia Maya, 50. Yay. Eddie. Eddie got 50. Ash got 50. Manny got 49. See, even though Manny didn't get the exact number and neither did um, Lori, y'all still get points. So even if you don't know, guess, put in, go put in a number. Yeah, you're first. You did. I said it. Pixar's Lightyear launches in theaters telling the backstory of the human buzz that inspired the toy. June of what year? Uh, Lightyear. Okay. Pixar's Lightyear. It tells a story about Buzz Lightyear, his backstory. I haven't seen that one. Okay. Ash says 2022. Eddie says 95. Manny says 22. Oh, this isn't, this isn't the regular Toy Story. This is Lightyear, which is Buzz's backstory. I want to see that. I, I never saw that movie. In fact, I had totally forgotten about it because I was like, when I was putting it down, I'm like, what? And I'm like, oh, I remember now. Me and my and my potatoes. 22. 22. Good job. Manny got 22. Ash got 22. Um, Eddie, you and Lori, I think you're thinking about the regular, um, the regular one. Where are you getting these numbers from? <laughs> the mischief, mischief, mischievous. Okay. <laughs> Pair of chipmunks, Chip and Dale, make their first on-screen appearance in April of what year? What year was Chip and Dale's first appearance? It, I think it, it's it's when you get it in. Okay. Now, 2022, Chip and Dale. Hi, I'm Manny's sister. Hello, Manny's sister. I hope y'all are going to have a wonderful time in, in Hawaii. 
Pula for me. <laughs> 1943. Um, Asher off, babe. Refresh. Or go out and come back in. All right. The correct answer is 43. 43. So all of y'all were off by quite a bit, but that's still okay. Eddie, Eddie got the closest with 60. So he got 56 points. Then Lori Jean said 65. Um, Chip and Dale is an older, it's an older cartoon. All right. The Mighty Ducks skate in the theaters and introduce audience to the triple deck and the famous Flying Bee. October of what year? You were helping your, your brother with something. Gotcha. Gotcha. You've got to get, I know, Manny. Well, just take our thoughts with you, Manny. All right. Gabby says 90, 92, 91. Eddie's 91. Manny was 92. Lori is 92. I have a foot. I have a cat on my foot. I can't move. <laughs> He's laid down on my foot. And the Mighty Ducks. When were they, the 90 Ducks were in 1992. So Ash got it perfect. Then Eddie, I said 90. And then Gabby got, uh, I mean, Eddie said 91 and Gabby said 90. It's okay. If y'all don't know, guess because I'm, because so you can see, even if you guess wrong, you're still going to get points. It depends on how far away you are. All right. Pixar's Coco premiere premieres in Mexico the weekend before Dia de los Muertos. Muertos. I don't know how to say that word. I'm not even going to try. October of what year? Coco premiered in Mexico the weekend before whatever that is. <laughs> in what year? <laughs> Ash says 2017. All right, Mia, is it going to catch in? Eddie says 2018. If you don't see your name pop up in the screen, put it in again real quick. So, because your name, you should be putting it up. And Lori, your yours might have gone in too quick. I might need to slow this down on the next one. This is kind of a trial. So, the next time I'll make it slower to put in your answers. I'll give you more time. All right. Manny got 2017. Ash, 2017. Eddie, 2018. Lori, 2015. And Gabby said 2020. So the correct was 2017. You've loved that movie. Yes. All right. Walt Disney wins his 59th Oscar for Winnie the Pooh and the Blustery Day, December of what year? Manny. Manny. Oh, Manny. You did a heart and it, it took your three. Be careful. You can't put in other numbers. It will take any number that you put in. So don't put in codes. <laughs> Gabby says 2012. Or 12, 12. Gabby, you said 12, 12. BC. <laughs> Eddie, 1958. Walt Disney wins his 59th Oscar for Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> the Blustery Day. Lori Jean said it's 2016. No, it's 20, hey, 1968. Eddie was closest. He's still 10, 10 years off, but Eddie was the closest. Good job, Eddie. Good job. Bye, my potatoes. Me and Maya, I hate that you're going because you're like doing super good with points. All right, Doc McStuffins makes her debut on Disney Junior as a young girl who fixes broken toys. March of what year? <laughs> Love ya, Mia. I'm glad you came to play. You're doing super great. I mean, like really good. <laughs> 
Hold on. Hold on. We're going to see something real quick. Um, Mia, you're in third place right now. You are in third place. I had to go look real quick. I've never done that before. <laughs> you are in third place, Mia. All right. Doc McStuffins made her debut on Disney Junior as a young girl who fixes toys in 2012. Ash said 2020. So Ash was the closest. Good job, Lori. 2020, uh, 2001. So it doesn't matter if you go over, it's the spread. <clears throat> It's the spread. I didn't know if it was going to be without going over, but it's not. It's just the spread. All right. The Mickey Mouse Club premieres on TV asking, who's the leader of the fan of the club that's made for you and me? M-I-C-K-E-Y-M-O-U-S-E. -E, October of what year? I know, Grandma, don't sing. Oh, uh, Manny, I can tell you it's not 2020. <laughs> it's not 2020. The Mickey Mickey Mouse, Eddie is closer than 2020. Mickey Mouse Club was a long time ago. Lori, Lori says 56. All right, let's see. The correct, oh, 55, Lori, Lori. Oh, Ash got in first. Ash said 55, Lori said 56. It was 55, Eddie 51. Good job, y'all. Yeah, the old Mickey Mouse. I can see them marching around. Yeah, that tells you how old we are. <laughs> and I know the song. The Lion King's Timon and Pumbaa pum premieres, giving the bug-eating buddies their own TV show. September of what year? The TV show. Lion King's Timon and Pumbaa get their TV show September of what year? Grandma, you can sing with me tomorrow. Oh, that'd be scary. <laughs> The jury may never come back. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's funny. All right. Let's see. When did they get their own television show? It was 95. All right. 95. Who got the closest? Ash. Ash got 95. Gabby got 95. Ash just beat you, Gabby. <laughs> <laughs> Ash's equations worked on that. <laughs> Manny, 200 BC. This is silly. <clears throat> All right. Scrooge McDuck makes his introduction into a Donald Duck comic book. December of what year? Scrooge McDuck. Make makes his introduction in a Donald Duck comic book. Now, the comic book. That's not news. <laughs> All right. Eddie, 66. Lori, 59. I'll put in some dates. Gabby said 96. Y'all don't know. Just put in numbers. It really doesn't matter. You get points. It's just how many points do you get? <laughs> May, uh, oh, it's it's 47. 47. So it's the comic book now. If Manny's got a roll. Need to go somewhere right now. Yes. <laughs> It's Hawaii. <laughs> hope you have more. I hope you have a great night. Bye, Gabby, Ash, everybody. Thank you. Uh, Manny, be safe, okay? You and your family be safe. 
We love you. All right. Fun and fancy free debuts in theaters. And it is the last time Walt Disney lends his voice as Mickey Mouse. September of what year? You keep getting an, an error. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Give your grandma a hug for me. <laughs> Gabby's laughing at you, Ash. All right. Let's see. When did Fun and Fancy Free debut? And it was the last time Walt Disney was the voice of Mickey Mouse. It was 1947. 1947. Long time ago. All right. Eddie said 69. He is the closest. Good guess. It was he was way back. He he stopped long, 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 long time before. He let he he just retired. <laughs> Gabby 76 and Lori said 79. No, Ash. Ash is having issues tonight. All right. Go out and come back in, Ash. <clears throat> All right. Alston and Allie balance stardom and stage fright on its Disney Channel debut. Austin and Allie. Austin and Allie debuted in December of what year on the Disney Channel? I don't know Austin and Allie. <clears throat> All right. So Ash says 2011. Gabby, 2001. Eddie says 2013. Lori, 2010. All right, let's see. Oh, 2011. Ash, you and Lori. All right. Ash got it. Good job, Ash and Lori. Right behind you. Good job. Eddie, I... I probably would have guessed that too, honestly. All right. Disney's 30th animated feature film, Beauty and the Beast, premieres in November of what year? Beauty and the Beast, the animated feature. All right. The animated feature of Beauty and the Beast was Disney's 30th animated film that's cool november of what year gabby just guess <laughs> for make a make a good guess just say like 20 something or 19 something <laughs> use your ai-ness <laughs> and he said 95 Lori said 92 All right, 91, 91, Ash said 91, Ash got in there, 91, good job, Ash got it, Lori got points with 92, all right, then Eddie and then Gabby, Gabby, say just to use a, an, we know it's going to be 20 or 2000 something or 19 something, 1900s. <laughs> the Rescuers debut, uh, debuts and becomes the first animated film to inspire the a sequel. December of what year? <laughs> he put in 14.5 points. <laughs> I think yeah, that's your see you can't put a number. <laughs> it takes all numbers. <laughs> all right, Gabby, Gabby, it took your 14.5. So <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Let's say 96, 77, 72. All right. Looks like Eddie's got it. Yes, it was 1976. So Eddie got got point the most points with. Oh no, oh Ash, it did. It, Ash, it, it 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 took out your other one. No, that was that was uh Gabby. Gabby got the 14.5. <laughs> 
but you got 17 points for it. <laughs> it's good there are not that many people in your playing, Gary. The Chipmunks lead a secret international organization in Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers. March of what year? What year was Chippendale Rescue Rangers? I know, Gabby, you still got points, girl. <laughs> it takes it for how many people are in here. So if there were a lot of people in here, you wouldn't have gotten the points. But this is this is this is for fun. We are trying to see how this game works and have some fun with Disney. All right, we'll do this. I do like this game. The Chipmunks, Chippendale Rescue Rangers, March of what year? What year? 1989. 1989. All right, Lori Jean got a 1987. Good job. Good job. That was super close. Chippendale. Gabby said 95. Eddie, Eddie, I'm with you. I would have thought an earlier, honestly. I would have, because Chippendale is an older one. Pocahontas is released and it is the first Disney animated feature based on historical fact. So the government says. <laughs> Sorry, conspiracy theories came in my head right there. June of what year? <laughs> Wrong trivia, Grandma. <laughs> 2012. Gabby says 19. So Lori said 2012. Eddie says 2009. Gabby said 1999. Ash says 95. I like how it pulls your your stuff up. I do like that. It shows your so shows what you're saying on the on the screen. It'll go a lot faster when there's a lot of people in here. All right, Gabby got it. It was 1995. So Gabby got the closest with 1999 and then Eddie with 2009. Good job, y'all. Good job. Pocahontas. I remember when that came out. That was really, that's a really good one. I did like that one. The first nine issues of Mickey Mouse magazine featuring short stories, articles, gags, games, and poems is released January of what year? Mickey Mouse magazine. It had short stories, articles, gags, Games and Poems, January of what year? 95. <laughs> Ash is like, mm. <laughs> Lori says 68. Eddie says 56. Uh, it's, see, you put in the wrong equations, Ash. You did it to yourself. <laughs> You put in the wrong equation. <laughs> it's on you, girl. All right. It was 1933. When I read gags, I was like, oh, that's old. Eddie got 56. So uh, it said 56. So that's the closest. Yeah. When I read that, I was like, okay, you can tell that's older. I'm trying to get my color right. There we go. Um. Pixar's Finding Nemo premieres showing just how far a father's love can go. A good father is what we should say. <laughs> May of what year? Finding Nemo. May of what year? Ash put in a different code. <laughs> 2016. Lori says 2016. Eddie says 2014. Now Ash is saying 2033. What? <laughs> well, we know that's wrong. Gabby, 2015. Now Ash says 2003. Uh, well, you already put in 2033. <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh my goodness. It took it. You got it. It did take your 2003 number. All right. Ash got it. It was 2003. You pressed the wrong button. Well, it took it. It took it. It took it. So you lucked out. Maybe that code did work. <laughs> The live action film adaptation of The Little Mermaid splashes into theaters May of what year? Now, this is the live version, not the animated. The live action film Little Mermaid splashes into theater May of what year? <laughs> Cammie. Cammie says you're awesome. <laughs> Eddie says 92. Gabby says 92. But Eddie was first. Lois says 95. Ash says 2023. Oh. Hmm. Let's see. The live version. When was the live version? 2023 yes they did they weren't doing the live versions i don't believe in the 1900s <laughs> i think they started doing and he said 2019 um you changed it yeah i i believe i don't know y'all i don't know these things so take what i say with a grain of salt i think they didn't start doing the live until the 2000s all right, Pixar's superhero family film, The Incredibles, is released in theaters November of what year? Oh, my goodness. The Incredibles. My son, when he was little, oh, I was do going through some stuff with my ex. And um, we have Carowinds Passes, which is a, like an amusement park. And he wouldn't let, we wouldn't let me uh, share a pass. I had to buy a pass and he had to buy pa season passes. And uh, Carowinds was like, you can only have one pass per kid. So I let them pick their names. And my son picked his name was Dash. Like that, that, that family, the little boy in that, in that family. So we named him Dash Flash. <laughs> No, fast. It was fast. Dash fast. <laughs> Ash got it. It's 2004. 2004. Eddie was 2017. So did Gabby and Lori. No, 2004. Uh-oh. Ash's equations are starting to work, y'all. <laughs> the Horned King captures Hen Wren, the clairvoyant pig, in the animated film, The Black Cauldron, July of what year? That's uh, Clumsy's friend. <laughs> Clumsy clairvoyant. <laughs> the Horned King captures Hen Wren, the clairvoyant pig, in the animated film, The Black Cauldron, uh, July of what year? All right, Gabby, so 2017, Eddie says 1999. Now, oh, Gabby's saying 2000. Ash says 1985. All right, it was 1985. Ash! <laughs> but it didn't get you. You did it too slow. <laughs> Eddie got it. Eddie got it. 1999. 1999. Oh, I don't know why my color is getting all messed up. Oh, well. We'll just have to lean into the camera. All right. The Pixar short, Bounden, featuring a sheared sheep, premieres November of what year? The short. Remember the sheep? The short with the sheep on it. Bounden premiered November of what year? Ah, Ash, I is not fixed. <laughs> Recount. 
Oh, all right. Gabby says 2004. Eddie says 2013. But Eddie, it didn't pop up on the screen. Eddie, put it in real quick. It didn't catch it. Y'all, if you don't see it pop up on the screen, put it in again real quick because it only got Gabby's. It's the internet. It's the internet. I'm going to message them because um, this is, we're going to have to do this game like we did with Wordle. As we see things, I'll have to um, message them. I swear I had it before the timer was up. I believe you. I believe you. I'm going to message them. Um, it has nothing to do with my internet. So two inventing stepbrothers and a secret agent platypus are introduced when Phineas and Ferb debuts Feb February of what year? I love Phineas, Phineas and Ferb. I've actually read some of those books, some of the Phineas, Phineas and Ferb books on my grandma's house channel. So y'all can go listen to me and read some Phineas and Ferb. I love them. <laughs> the secret agent. Platypus. I can't remember the platypus's name right now. Um, it might come to me. All right. 2008. 2008. So Ash got it in quicker. I mean, closest. 2007. And then Gabby and Eddie, both of y'all said 2019. And my kids used to watch it. So I would, I, I would have known that that was an earlier one. Phineas and Ferb. <laughs> Ash, is, Ash, don't look so angry. <laughs> Beauty and the Beast opens on Broadway. It will become the eighth longest running production in history. April of what year? And I believe when we were doing the um, musical, Broadway musicals trivia, I believe we talked about Beauty and the Beast, if I remember correctly, which <laughs> me and my brain image, I don't know if I remember correctly or not. <laughs> I could be just dreaming that up in my head. All right. Gabby's is 2008. Eddie said 2015. Ash, we're waiting on you. Uh-oh. Ash is missing in action. Ash is 1994. It's 1994, but you got it in too slow. Ash. Oh, no, you didn't. You got it in there. You got it in there. It just hadn't popped in. 1994. Good going, Ash. There you go. <laughs> I wrote. <laughs> In 1994. Good job. Everybody wants to be a cat. When the animated feature, The Aristocats, premieres, December of what year? Uh, everybody liked The Aristocrats. Everybody wanted to be a cat when the animated feature, Aristocats, premiered December of what year? Thank you, Gabby. Y'all, please go right now. If you're watching this on replay, like, subscribe, click, click all the buttons. Be grandma a solid. <laughs> My daughter would have just said that was cringy, grandma. <laughs> all right. 2006, 1970, 1960. It was 1972 when Aristocrats premiered. Ash got the closest. Um, Eddie, I don't know why yours didn't show up, but I am. I will. Uh, I will contact them. We're gonna have to work on this game like we did with Wordle. It'll get better. <laughs> I did get grandma. Yes. <laughs> Pixar's Ratatouille premieres as audience root for Remy the Rat following his culinary passion in Paris, June of what year? When was Ratatouille? When did it premiere? 
June of what year? Gabby says 2010. Yes. So anybody who is watching replay, you can watch any of my games on replay. Just play like you're watching a game show on television and try and beat the chat. But we would love, love, love for you to come and play with us. Grandma is going to play this game. I don't know when we're going to do it, when the schedule is going to be, but I do like this game. It's fun. It's different. And I got plenty of info over here. All right. It's 2007. 2007. The next time we'll do something, we'll do different. We, we'll do the random stuff, not just uh, Disney. But I do have a lot of Disney. All right. 2007. Ash got it. Ash got it. Eddie, I don't know why it didn't take you. I'll spam it so it sees me. Don't do that. No spamming in grandma's chat. <laughs> The animated feature Robin Hood, my daughter's favorite, is released during Disney's golden anniversary, November of what year? My daughter, that is my daughter's absolute favorite, favorite, favorite. Yeah, she even got, uh, she even got a tattoo. <laughs> Of, of, uh, no, no, it wasn't. No, she got, um, no, it wasn't Robin Hood that she got. Oh, um, now I can't think what she loves Robin Hood, though. Robin Hood and Little John walk through the forest. <laughs> Ash got it. It was 1973 and 1973. Good job. Lori said 51. Gabby said 95. 73. I love Robin Hood. Oh, what's the one with Tigger? But Peter Pan. Peter Pan. The Peter Pan was our favorite, not Robin Hood. Grandma's brain. All right. In Search of the Castaways opens... It is Disney's second film based on a Jules Verne novel. December of what year? In Search of the Castaways. Oh, I remember that one. In Search of the Castaways opens. And it's the second film based on a Jules Verne novel. December of what year? How many questions? 35. So we have two more. It should take about the same amount of time. I am going to give it a little bit more time on the guessing part um, for the next time. <clears throat> All right. So the correct answer was 62, Ash. Or maybe I shouldn't because that way y'all can't Google it all. <laughs> oh, I, this wasn't bad. Once you get used to playing it, I think it's easier. All right, Ash got 62, Eddie had 80, Lori, Lori had a double number in there, but you would have, you were close. Pluto is referred to by name for the first time in Disney short film, The Moose Hunt, May of what year? That's a really good trivia question. <clears throat> I might be using that in the future. Pluto is referred to by name for the first time in a Disney in the Disney short film The Moose Hunt May of what year I didn't see the numbers on top oh yeah um Eddie says 39 Lori says 45 I wasn't googling I just guessed honestly it was your grandma's birthday oh that's super cool now, I'm not saying that y'all are Googling. I'm just saying uh, in the future, I was going to put more time, but I think I might not. Um, Ash got it. Ash said 31. Eddie was close, 39. And Lori said 45. Uh, Gabby was way off, way off. <laughs> the moose. Pluto. Pluto was way before 1990, Gabby. Frozen is released 
later winning Oscars for Best Animated Feature and Original Song. November of what year? What year was Frozen released? What year was Frozen released? Gabby, you know I gotta, I gotta fuzz out. Yeah, <laughs> calling her out. She cheats. <laughs> GG. <laughs> oh my goodness. We got to keep her on her toes. <laughs> we we'll have to shorten up the time so she can't Google this stuff. She can't ask Alexa. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. That's funny. All right. When was Frozen released? 2013. 2013. Frozen was released in 2013. Ash got it. Oh, Gabby was super close. I'm sorry, Eddie. I'm going to tell them that these aren't going in. So I know what they're going to say, but at least I'll let them know. They're going to say, well, it could be the connection between you and YouTube and YouTube going into them. All right, y'all. Oh, that was the last question. I wasn't even paying attention. Ash. Ah. Oh. Ash, Ash got 1,721.2 points. Eddie, Eddie came in second with 1,016.9. Lori came in third with 825.1. Yay. And then Gabby, Manny, and my, me and Maya. And Mia was doing super good. When I looked, she was in third place. So let me see if it changed. Yeah, it did. It did. Um, there's a. I thought it was going to show on the on the screen, but it didn't. Um, so I'm glad I tested that out. <laughs> so y'all, that was super good. I got a lot wrong, so remember that. <laughs> It's because you had the wrong codes in. <laughs> it's not fun when it's, you're right. You're right. Oh, <laughs> sorry, grandma. You're right. No, I, she, she missed a lot. She wasn't even here. She's not getting this. I will say when, when she was playing Star Trek, she was asking her husband. So those were actually her husband's, her, her husband's answers. <laughs> Y'all did good. Did you like that game? Did you like that? I'm just over it. Oh, I know. Today. Whew, today. Um. <laughs> I'm that, that's why I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna at first I was thinking I would make the answer time longer, but I'm not. That way I'm I'm not worried about Ash. I I, I don't think Ash is Ash isn't um, cheating. Um, I, I, I don't think anybody in here was cheating. I'm thinking the younger ones, when they come in, they'll be asking. Um, like Manny was like, I'm asking my grandmother. His grandmother was sitting there. Um, but the younger ones will, they will. So if I make the time period to put the answers in, if I, if you, if I give you more time, then they will be able to Google or, you know, Alexa or whatever. So I'm not going to do that. I can make the result time longer, but there's no need to make that time either. So I think I'm just keep it like it is. And as we get more people in here and as we, um, as, as we get used to the game, um, I can actually shorten that time down right now. It's at 35 seconds. I can make it like 30 seconds. Um, <clears throat> so you have to put it in real quick. I want to give you time to be able to read it because a lot of people will, We'll be reading it before I'm finished saying it. Um, but seriously, I always have a great time here. And you're always so awesome. Love y'all. Yes, thank you. You loved it. Thank you, Ash, for beating me. Ash is just smart. It's like my daughter. My daughter doesn't Google this stuff. She just 
thinks about what was going on in that time period, like she would have gotten a lot of these right because of like, you know, Peter Pan. As she knows I used to sing, you know, the song and I watched, the, oh, that was, I love Peter Pan. Um, not Peter Pan, Robin Hood. I love Robin Hood. She liked Peter Pan. Peter Pan was her favorite. Um, so she would think about what's going on in, when she remembers that movie or that show or whatever. And then she thinks about what was going on in her life, then how old she was. And then that's how she deducts to figure out what date or what, you know, what time period or whatever. She's really good at, at that. I just won't participate anymore. Be, oh, no, Ash, Ash, I, I know you're not. I want you to play. Um, while Ash wins, now she's trying to kick me out. No, no, nobody, nobody is cheating. I don't think anybody's cheating. I just, I don't want the kids. I don't want the kids to come in and do that. Y'all aren't. Y'all aren't. Thought you said goodbye. Oh, no. Um, Lori. Lori said that. I don't know if, I don't know if Lori was being serious or joking. Um, but no, I don't think anybody in here is. You had plenty of them wrong. You, well, okay. So here's the thing. If Ash was cheating <laughs> last night, she would have gotten all 35 wrong. I mean, right. Oh, my, my color. She would have gotten all 35 right. And out of 35 questions, she only got 29. So if you were consistently getting them all right, then I would say, okay, but you didn't. I mean, last night was hard and, you know, you got the first spot, but she only got 29 right. That's why I was picking on you. <laughs> I don't think anybody is cheating. I don't. Um, you would have gotten a perfect, I would have gotten perfect scores. <laughs> yes, if you're cheating. <laughs> you're cheating, you would have gotten perfect scores and nobody has gotten all of them right. Nobody on any of anything that I've done. Nobody has gotten them all right. Um, Ash is, a, yes, no, Ash. Gabby's a robot. She's AI. <laughs> so I know what you're doing. <laughs> ah, you do rock. You do. I would like to see Ash and my daughter doing stuff like that, especially like my daughter, like with the um, um, 21st century uh, pop stuff, or was it 21st century pop culture? Yeah, she's super good at that. Super good. She knows all of the memes and all of the stuff that was going on and all that. She knows all that stuff. <clears throat> Last night, I knew a lot of them because my mom and dad were rock fans. Yeah. See, that's what my daughter does. My daughter knows my daughter knows the things that she knows that she can relate to what she was doing in her life. But she also knows all the things from the 80s and the 70s and some 60s because of me. And 50s and stuff. And, you know, because of me and her grandparents and stuff. So she just remembers all that stuff and can relate it to what was going on. What do, what do I remember was happening? And so that's what, she, that's how she does it. Deductive, deductive reasoning. I, I have taught her how to figure that stuff out. Before I came here, I was watching a documentary on Lollapalooza. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so interesting. Yeah, that's that kind of stuff is cool. I like that kind of stuff too. I do. Well, y'all, I'm glad you had fun. I'm glad. Y'all did good. Eddie, woohoo. <laughs> and Lori, Lori did good. So all three of y'all, super good. Gabby, Gabby will get there. <laughs> Y'all, um, thank you again for coming and testing this out. Um, we'll try and figure out when I can do. Um, oh, this is irritating me with that like. Um, we'll we'll figure out a good time to do it. Um, I'll just do it random probably. Um, 
because I've got so many things. So tomorrow I have um, Wordle at 1215 in the afternoon Eastern. And then I have um, Bible tomorrow night. Um, again, I'm not on screen. I'm just in the chat. It's a really quick one. It's only like 25 minutes. And then um, there's only 15 questions. And then Thursday, I have um, Wordle. And then um, Thursday night, I have uh, the regular time. I have more or less. And we will draw for... Um, I forgot. <laughs> I just didn't realize last night it was the end of the month. So I'll do the drawing after more or less on Thursday. And then on Friday, we'll do Kahoot at night, 7.15 at night. All right. So anyway, that's the schedule. And I, I will have words on stream going. Um, tomorrow, I'll probably switch it over. I've got a, a, a new computer coming as a cheap one just to run it so hopefully that'll help so i won't have to keep taking it down so anyway all right guys lots going on always check the community tab to see what's going on or if grandma has to cancel or whatever but anyway y'all let me know uh, uh your thoughts in the comments and i will see you later sweet dreams gabby <laughs> Love y'all.